to decorate this space for an American Girl room using some of our previous crafts. This is a room out of the My Girls dollhouse. And we are going to start decorating it one room at a time. Because right now, it's, it's pretty much a mess. Most of the rooms look something like this. Just overflowing with stuff. So we are going to go one room at a time, cleaning it out, and fixing it up. So let's get started. Starting with an empty room, we are going to change the wall color. So I am going to cover them with scrapbook paper. And using a glue stick, I am just gluing this directly onto the wall and smoothing it out so there's no bubbles. I used a light blue damask on the top, a textured blue on the bottom, then I added some paper with a wood grain trim around the middle and the window. And now we have our room. And another option for creating your American Girl room is to use a large box or one of my personal favorites, a trifold. Okay, so now we need a bed. And this is our version of the bouquet bed made with an American Girl box. And I would really like to put it like this against the wall. I might want a nightstand right there, so I'm just gonna scoot it over a little. Here is our doll dresser with working drawers. Yeah, they're a little crooked. <laughs> but, and you know, and I actually don't like the color that we use for the dresser now. It doesn't really go. So I have to recover it. I could have used the same paper, but I like a little variation in the room. Then we made a small one without the drawers to be a bookcase on the other side. And I've got a few mini books that I've bought, like these American Girl notebooks, and a few that I've made. Add a few knickknacks, and our desk lamp. Above the bed, we added an American Girl drawing pad, our Polaroid camera, a teapot with flowers, one of our cell phones from our doll selfie stick video, and right now, I'm just adding a whole bunch of fun details, like keys from our doll wallet video, a trophy, ooh, a guitar is a fun detail, and keychains are fun. Can you open this for me? Sure. Please be stitch. You gotta tear it on the side, the little notch. <laughs> All right, there we go. Come on, Stitch, Olaf. come on. Olaf, oh, well, that'll work too. So I just remove the hardware to make a fun little figurine for the doll's room. Aw, that's cute. We need a book bag. It will look better over here on the floor. Here is a little camera keychain, and it actually lights up and makes little noises. Maybe our doll is into photography. I am going to use a knit doily as a rug, our doll house slippers, I glued some burlap onto a piece of cardboard, glued some skinny sticks around it, glue on some buttons, add a little poster putty to the back for a jewelry holder. I can even use a push pin to add a picture. Add some art from our doll art room video. It's looking pretty good. However, this wall is kind of bare. So I'm going to add our printable door from our doll townhouse video and our printable light switch and outlets. Outlets are such a fun little detail. And I think this is good, so uh, I think we're done. Let's see how Gabby likes her new room. Oops, forgot the horse. And a personal touch. So Gabby, what do you think? I love it! What a cute little horse. I just did all that work and all she takes from it is the horse. Well, we hope you enjoyed taking a look around our American Girl doll room. We want to give a shout out to Ashley Vicky. What's up?